I think I think the main thing that comes off listening to this album is you seem to be saying that you feel somewhat trapped by the image you build up over the years. Is this an accurate reading of it? Um, I wouldn't say trapped. I think uh, to say I was trapped would, would mean that I felt kind of victimized. I mean, you, yeah. you can't possibly really be victimized by something that you did yourself. Yeah. You know, um, I'm not the type of artist that was kind of pushed from behind into a certain position by managers or people around me. I chose my path. Um, but it is definitely part of the, um, the reason that this album sounds the way it does, is my kind of dissatisfaction with the position I've left myself in. And did you feel yourself being sucked into the whole Hollywood star well, machinery? I mean, you see, the thing is, I'd always kind of had a, uh, remained at arm's length from American celebrity because Wham, uh, while Wham was going on, I was still predominantly an, uh, uh, a British star, and I lived in Britain, still do. But having set my sights on kind of the American, uh, on American status, I suppose, when uh, I went for when I went for the, I suppose I, I went for that bracket that was Madonna and Prince and Jackson, and everything around Faith was engineered towards that. And I think having having succeeded to a large extent, I realised that I'd kind of aimed, uh, and I'd um, not exactly misfired, but I ended up in the wrong room with the wrong people, almost, you know. Okay and just that our objectives were slightly different and that if I tried to carry on in, in that way then I would really make myself unhappy. Again, I'm saying this now and this is, this is where I feel right now. Maybe in five years time I'll be back, you know. All right. Show business. Um.